Hello and welcome to our ninth video in the series on automotive sensors. In this series, we will explain the function and working of each automotive sensors in detail. Today we're going to dive deep into the world of NOx sensors. We'll explore what they are, how they work, and why they are crucial for your vehicle's performance. See description for links to the playlist. Let's get started. First, let's understand what a NOx sensor is. A NOx sensor is a small device located in the engine that detects knocking or pinging sounds during combustion. Knocking occurs when the air-fuel mixture ignites too early, causing potential damage to the engine. Now, why is this sensor important? If knocking happens continuously, it can lead to severe engine damage, poor performance, and reduced fuel efficiency. The NOx sensor helps prevent this by allowing the engine control unit or ECU, to adjust the engine timing accordingly. Let's break down how the NOx sensor works. Step by step, NOx sensor is usually mounted on the engine block. Its position allows it to effectively monitor engine vibrations. When the engine runs, vibrations occur. If knocking happens, it produces specific vibrations at certain frequencies. The NOx sensor contains piezoelectric material. When it detects these vibrations, it generates an electrical signal based on the intensity of the vibrations. This electrical signal is sent to the ECU. The ECU interprets the signal to determine if knocking is occurring. If it detects knocking, it adjusts the engine's timing and fuel mixture to reduce the knocking. By making these adjustments, the knock sensor helps to prevent further knocking and protects the engine from damage. There are mainly two types of knock sensors. One, piezoelectric sensors. These are the most common. They generate an electrical charge when subjected to pressure, making them highly sensitive to vibrations. 2. Microphone-based sensors. These sensors use microphones to detect sound waves. While effective, they are less common in modern vehicles. How do you know if your knock sensor is failing? Watch for these symptoms. If your engine feels sluggish or loses power, the warning light may turn on. If you notice increased fuel consumption, if your engine shakes or vibrates excessively at idle, if you suspect your knock sensor is faulty, you can test it yourself. Here's how. You'll need a multimeter, a repair manual for your vehicle, and basic hand tools. Find your knock sensor in the engine bay. It's usually mounted on the engine block. Carefully unplug the electrical connector from the NOx sensor. Set your multimeter to resistance mode. Connect the meter to the sensor terminals. Check the resistance against the specifications in your repair manual. If the readings are out of range, it may be time to replace the NOx sensor. If everything checks out, reconnect it securely. A faulty NOx sensor may not produce a distinct sound on its own, but it can lead to engine knocking or pinging sounds often described as a rattling or metallic noise during acceleration. This noise typically occurs when the air-fuel mixture ignites too early, causing irregular combustion. That's a detailed look at knock sensors. We hope you now have a better understanding of how they work and their importance in your vehicle. Our next video in this series will be on ABS wheel speed sensor. If you found this video helpful, please like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more automotive tutorials. Thank you for watching, and drive safely.